What's good YouTube? Back with another one. Before we get into it, make sure you guys hit that like, hit that share, hit that subscribe button. Appreciate you guys for hitting that like button. Make sure you guys go subscribe to the new channel. I'm going to be posting all the Instagram live videos as well as doing video reactions. So if you're not already tapped in, make sure you guys go tap in right now. The link will be in the description box. But let's get right into it, man. I just want to talk about this coma situation real quick and add my two cents. And I want to say, man, I think we're focusing on the wrong thing. Because at the end of the day, Chromas is grown. Chromas could do whatever she wants with whoever she wants, right? But it's just the way she used the N-word that really gets to me, right? I feel like context is everything. Like, I got white people that could call me an N-word, it's all good. I got brown people that could call me an N-word, it's all good. I got all type of people, you know what I'm saying? But it's just the way she uses it. And just the way she speaks to black people, black men in general, you feel me? Like, I noticed... The academics thing made me really, really notice. Like, I noticed how she talks to the guys in Toronto, but the academics and the Adam 22 thing made me really take notice of it because she talks about academics. Like, academics is just some bum N word from off the street and like no jumpers, like some top, you know what I'm saying? Some big guys, some more respectable, like upper class, you know what I'm saying? And I'm saying, like, what? How? Like Adam 22 allegedly is a man that lets people F his wife on camera, does all type of crazy shit like that real men don't do. Like I know academics are foo-foo guy, but come on, like at least academics has some dignity. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like who does stuff like that? Like, and then she talks about academics like he's a waste you, like he's a this and he's dad, like he's nobody. And if you notice, academics actually posted people from Toronto on his main Instagram to try to give them a buzz. What did Adam22 do other than interview Smiley, Presser, and K Showtime? And those guys are already popping. Academics is actually trying to help Toronto. And she's trying to talk to the man like he's some nobody. Like, what is, Academ what is Adam22 doing? And now the man is like, yo, he's not going to mess with Toronto because of this girl. You guys should probably apologize to Academics, you feel me? And I want to say this, man. How is Chromas allowed to use the N-word so freely, but you guys try to make this big deal about Lady SB? What's the difference between Chromas and Lady SB? I want to know in the comment section, man. But I think it's time we forget about Chromas, leave her in the past, and focus on some of the more talented female rappers in the city. Give them the buzz. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section, man. Am I losing it once again? But I think it's time Chromas gives us an apology. And it's time for her to stop using the n-word that's just my thoughts let me know if i'm tripping once again in the comment section man am i losing it or do i have a point man let me know your thoughts hit that like hit that share hit that subscribe button even if you're not subscribed man make sure you hit that like button it really helps with the algorithm and make sure you guys go follow me on twitch link will be in the description box you don't know